Welcome to Manchester United. It was all about Ronaldo and Rashford and what they eat and what they don't eat. He's um, trying to get children in schools to get free school meals. So if you could have lunch with any footballer in the world, who would you pick? Ronaldo. 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 He's the best player ever. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. What's going to happen today is Bam's going to make you up a little bit of a snack so you can taste it and then you can compare this snack versus your own snack later on today and then Pete and Kayla are going to help them and they're going to come out and help you make your wrap up later on. It's going to be great fun. What do you think the players eat for their lunch? Um, vegetables. Probably healthy yeah. things. They need to keep fit. Um, salad. Oh yeah, and chicken. Fish, chicken, vegetables, pasta, fruit, red meat, yogurt, pulses, rice are all different food offers, food items that's necessary for your body. So the carbohydrates that you eat after the match, which are things like pizza and potato wedges and deep fried chicken, that all gets eaten after the game to help the body recover quickly. But before the game, they eat all the healthier stuff because it doesn't sit in your tummy and therefore you can't run about as much. Yeah. You really need to get fed down. If you are fed, you can run. Everybody gather around, please. Okay, so the list of the ingredients we have today, okay? We have some summer fried chicken. We have some baby jam lettuce, peppers, tomatoes, cucumber. We have some herbs, we have some dill, we have some chives. This is all about building and tasting and trying something new. Okay, so let me see what you can do. So this, this one would be Paul Pogba. Okay. This would be a Paul Pogba at this one, full of tuna. Well, people like Marcus Rashford, they tend to stick to the chicken-based uh, chicken wraps. People like Paul Pogba, Cavani, they tend to go with more tuna. Uh, and then people like Ronaldo, he doesn't eat any wraps, he just has salads constantly. So if you could have lunch with any footballer in the world, who would you pick? Um, I would pick um, Ronaldo. Messi. Ronaldo. No. Ronaldo. Okay. Ronaldo. 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 He's the best player ever. No, I'm not. I love Ronaldo. Ronaldo. No. <laughs> no. 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 He's, um, trying to get children in schools to get free school meals. That's really good because there's some kids who can't really afford meals at school. I mean, yeah, I mean, Mark Flashford on his YouTube channel has been absolutely brilliant and it's helped push things forward with the, with the younger fans. Um, we do a younger fans menu based on healthy eating anyway. What did you learn about how the footballers eat? Did anything surprise you about that? Yeah, that like, really surprised me. Like, you think you eat like so 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 healthy and then they, and then you find out after the game that they eat like pizza and stuff that like chicken before the game they eat healthy things like salad they like pizza pasta <laughs> and like Hi, carbon carbon dioxide something so like <laughs> so the event's going really well today it's all about ronaldo and rashford and what they eat and what they don't eat it's, it's super important because if they, they start learning that at an early age We'll take it through with them right to adulthood, so it's really important for me to, to make sure they're healthy eating at the end of the day. It was a really good day today.